We're here at Bad Guys Worldwide Headquarters. Um, part of our engine building process is to inspect cranks, make sure they have the proper geometry, straight, round. Um, this one in particular, eat a bunch of bearings. Let me let's grab the uh, let's grab the one of the the rods. Red coal, zoom in on this. All right. Looks so great. that, that is about as bad as you can get. Completely wiped. And this is what the crank looks like. It doesn't, the crank doesn't look bad. You can't, you can't tell by just looking. You have to measure. So we have a, we have a mic here. And this one reads tenths of a thousandth. And we did the measurements. We'll, we mic'd it in a, how many different places? Four places or three? Three places. You know, Tell edge, them. yeah, edge, center, and bottom. And then our results are, uh, let's see here, when the means was so off result by is here. That's the a tape. thou, like a tape, the, the amount of taper was uh, a thou and six tenths. Uh, there should be zero, there should be no taper. This one is uh, seven tenths, four tenths. So basically, there was no hydrodynamic action going on since there was taper on on the journal, then oil would just gushed out on the on the large side. Um, then here we have a this is this is how we check the straightness of a crank. Is this set up? Yep. Yeah. This has this has about three tenths out around. I uh, have a strain by our boy Nippon Racing. Anything else, Cole? That's it. Just wanted to highlight that just because it looks shiny doesn't mean it's good to go. Nope. And unfortunately, this is, you know, a nice knife edge crank someone had, and now it's going to go into the scrap bin.